Yesterday, as you all know, we announced the 2022 Person of the Year, Volodymyr Zelensky and the Spirit of Ukraine. I want you just to imagine for a moment an alternate reality in 2022 with a different leader of Ukraine. The world and the events of the past year would have looked very different without Zelensky. And that's really the essence of what this franchise, this incredible 95-year-old tradition Person of the Year is. It was designed to capture the idea that fateful events on the global stage are shaped by the talents, by the priorities, by the fears, the foibles of individual human beings. This year, we tell the stories on our cover and in our reporting, not only of Zelensky, but of some extraordinary human beings who represent the spirit of Ukraine that swept the globe this year. It's my privilege to introduce our 2022 Person of the Year, appearing by video, President Volodymyr Zelensky. Ladies and gentlemen, it is an honor for me to represent the struggle of Ukrainians and the spirit of Ukraine, the spirit of freedom that echoes in the souls of so many people around the world. Stories of heroes who are fighting for independence are also your stories. Ordinary men and women who became brave hearts when they joined the defense forces to defend freedom. Different generations of different nations knew this spirit. Doctors who saved the wounded under bombs during blackouts or in occupation, no matter what it takes. It is about humaneness that we all value so dearly. Farmers who work the land under the roaring guns. It is about natural desire to live and take care of one's families and communities. Journalists who spread the truth. It is in the history of how to resist tyrants. The history which began even before the word journalism appeared. This is what inspires across all continents, freedom, fighters who may process nothing but courage to defeat those with armored vehicles and repression experience. When freedom wins and tyranny collapses, people are smiling the same way all over the globe. Lawyers who do not yet see the upcoming victory in war, but are already working to ensure that war criminals are brought to justice. This is the Nuremberg trials story with many other just verdicts that were delivered to those who believed in their impunity. This is the spirit. You have already seen the spirit of Ukraine on the covers of Time magazine. Not on each one, but on many. They were not Ukrainians on the covers before, but they were courage, striving for freedom, solidarity, creativity, and dedication, well known to the mankind from a long time ago, and which united the world this year with the colors of the Ukrainian national flag and our people's achievements. This is the free world spirit. And let's do everything for our spirit to win. I thank you for your attention. Thank you for supporting Ukraine. Slava Ukraini. Our immense gratitude to President Zelensky for being part of this evening.